Hi, this is Kanna Babu. This is part 9 of Errors. Before watching this video, you watch the previous video. In this video, we will write a program to convert string from lower case to upper case and upper case to lower case. So, right, before doing this example, we'll, we must know about a small basic concept. So, here we see, if you observe clearly that in your keyboard, you have different keys will be there. Something like small a to small z, capital A to capital Z, 0 to 9, dot, at the rate, underscore. Like lot of characters are there, lot of keys are there in your keyboard. Each and every character will have ASCII value. For example, small a to small z, ASCII value is 97 to 122. Capital A to capital Z, 65 to 90. 0 to 9, 48 to 57. So, we will dot at the rate underscore. Each and every character in your keyboard will have what? ASCII value. Is it clear? Now, if I ask one question that what will happen when we convert character into integer? Whenever you convert character to int, then the ASCII value of the character will be stored in the integer variable. Let us see here I will declare a class and here I will declare some main method, static void main method. And here I will try to declare one char. Char ch is equals to, let us assume I will give the small a. And here I will try to convert the char into integer. Int i is equals to convert dot 2 int 32 of ch. Now I will print the integer value. So let us see the output. So it is displaying the ASCII value of small a. So, whenever you convert a character int, then the ASCII value of the character will be stored in the integer variable. Similarly, if I give here small z, you can see 122. That is the ASCII value of small z. Similarly, if I give capital A, you can see 65. If I give capital Z, you can see 90. If you give 0, the ASCII value of 0 is 48. Similarly, if you give dot, I think something like 46, I think. And similarly, if you give at the rate, I think something 64, I think. And similarly, if I give underscore, the ASCII value is what? 95. Right? I hope you understood this point. And one more important point. What will happen when we convert int to char? For example, if I write int i is equals to 95. And uh, I will try to convert int to char. Char ch is equals to, here I will try to mention, convert dot to char of i. And here I will try to print the ch. So, what is the output? A. Sorry, underscore. That is the ASCII value of uh, 95. Similarly, if I give 90. Sorry, 97 I will give. 97 means small a. 97 to 122. Is it clear? Now, what is my question? Write a program to convert the lowercase character to uppercase character. So generally you can write a small program like this. Char ch is equals to, I will mention small a. Now I want to convert lower to upper. Here if you observe clearly, the ASCII value of small a to small z is uh, 90, 97 to 122 and capital A to capital z is 65 to 90. If you observe clearly, 97 minus how much, 65 is how much, 32. So, 97 minus 32 is how much? 65. That is the simple logic. Is it clear? 97 minus 32, you will get what? 65. So, if you want to convert lowercase to uppercase, what I have to do? Small j ASCII value is 97. So, I will try to convert this char into integer. Int i is equals to convert that to int 32 of ch. So, I have converted the ASCII, the character value into integer so the ASCII value will be stored in i. Now I will write i is equals to i minus 32. So i is how much? 97. 97 minus 32 is 65. Again I will convert the uh, integer value into character. Char ch1 is equals to. I will try to write something like convert dot. Convert dot to char. Convert dot to char of i. Now I will try to print what? ch1. So, here if you observe clearly, now my lower case is converted to what? Upper case. There is a program to convert the lower to what? Upper. If you want to convert upper to lower, here I will declare capital A and here I will try to write what? I plus 32. So, your output is what? Small a. Your capital A is converted to what? Small a. 
Now let us see, I want to write one program to convert what? Um, lower case string to upper case. So I have to write console.writeLearn of enter a string. Console.writeLearn of enter a string. I will declare one variable. String s is equals to console.readLine. Now I want to store the value in the string variable. Now what I will try to do, we already know that string is nothing but char array. So I will try to write what? char ch is equals to s dot to char array. Is it plus string is nothing but character array. Now I want to check whether um, I want to convert the lower case to upper case. Is it clear? So for that what I will try to do, uh, I will try to rotate the loop because in order to catch each and every character from the given string, I will write the for loop, for int initial, always index of the array start from 0, for int i is equal to 0, i less than equal to ch dot length minus 1, we already know length property is used to find the length of the given string or the length of the given array. Now I want to catch each character, so if uh, I want to convert the lower case to upper case. So here what I will try to do, I will try to convert the uh, character into what integer. So I will try to declare some variable, int x is equals to, I will try to convert the char into integer. So I will try to use what, convert dot 2 into 32 of ch of i, ch of i. ch of i means initial i is 0, ch of 0 means first character, ch of 1 means second, third, so on. Similarly x is equals to, I want to convert upper to lower means plus 32. That is upper. The uh, ASK value of capital A is 65. 65 plus 32 that is 97. So x is equal to x plus 32. And here I want to print what? Console dot write off x. Again I will try to convert the integer into char. So I will try to directly convert here. Convert dot to char. Convert dot to char of what? x. Is it clear? Console dot write. I want to place the cursor on the same line. After the um, for loop, I will try to throw the cursor to the next line. Let us see. Press of 5. It is asking me to enter a string. I will enter something like K A N N A B A B U. Capital letter. I got the output in lower case. This is a program to convert. So I am trying to validate now that string is nothing but what? Character array. So here I have what? K A N n a b a b u kannavabu and here i have what let us assume this is my string is it clear so string is nothing but what it is a character array so in a, so whenever you convert string into character array in a, the array each and every index number will start from what zero this is zero this is one two three four five six seven eight and the name of the array that I am trying to give is what? CH is the name of the array. Now here if you observe initial i is how much? 0. 0 means we are catching which value? CH of 0. K. This is uppercase. So what is the ASCII value of capital K? That is 90, uh, I think 65. Now 65 plus 32 how much? 97. So what is 97? Small k. So what is the output? Small k. Similarly i is how much? 1. 1 means at the index of 1, what is there? Capital A. Now what is the ASCII value of capital A? Uh, sorry. Uh, here the ASCII value of small k is not 65. You have to check that one. Capital A is 65. You can cross verify capital K. Like this you can what? Uh, write the program. If I give something like Microsoft. Microsoft, it is converted into lower case. This is a program to convert upper to lower. Similarly, if you want to write a program to convert lower to what? Upper. Here you give minus. X is equal to X minus 32. Here you can see. So, I, I will give here lower case. Kanna Babu. Is it clear? So, it is converted into upper case. Now, sometimes uh, if I ask you to write a program to convert lower to upper, upper to lower. For example, if I give something like KA, NN. A, B, A, B, U. So, my output is what, uh, what, I, what output I am expecting here is, my output is K must be capital, A small, N, N, A, B, A, B, U. This is the output what I am expecting. 
If the given character is lower, convert to what? Upper. If it is upper, convert to what? Lower. I want to convert lower to upper and upper to lower. In this case, first of all, I need to identify whether the character is lower or upper. That you must. So for that, what I will try to do here? Here I will try to catch the character. Something like this. And I will try to cut this code. And here I want to check whether the given character is lower or upper. So here I will try to write if uh, x if x lower means what 65 65 to sorry 97 to 122 if x greater than equals to 97 and x less than or equal to what 122 that is what lower case character similarly if x greater than or equal to 65 and x less than or equal to 90 that is what upper case character you don't write if else. If you write if else, there are lot of other characters are there like dot at the end underscore something like that. Now, if the given character is what within this range, this is what small a to small z. I want to cover uh, convert into upper. So x is equals to x minus what 32, and I want to print the x value. Console dot write off. Convert dot to care of x. Similarly, if it is what uh, lower case, I am converting into upper case. If it is upper case, I want to convert into what lower case. This is my program. Press F5. Here if I give K A N N A B A B U. Here you see. I think it is printing two times. Here in this pro problem program, a simple problem is that. For example, here if you observe clearly, here if I enter what small k. So once when I enter small k, here it will enter. If you want, I will debug and check the output. Here it will enter small k a n n a. Now here you see. When I enter what first of all it will catch the first character that is small k. Is it clear? So what is the SQL of small k? 107. So 107 greater than equals 97 and 107 less than equals to 122 condition is true. So x is how much? 75. 75 means capital K. Now here you see. Now here it is checking what 75 capital K. Now it is converted into lower. So the answer is double K will come. If you observe clearly here you see. K and what? K. Here you see. But uh, that is the reason what I will try to do. Here I will not use x. Here I will declare one more what? Variable. I will try to declare one more variable into what y. Are following? And it will compare with what y. And it also will try to add to y. Is it clear? So here I will try to print what y. Here press F5 and check the output. So here you can check. I will give the name. Here you see, lower case is converted into upper, upper is converted into lower. Did you understood? This is a very beautiful program. Convert lower to upper, upper to what? Lower. Okay, this is the program. I hope you understood. This is the program to convert what? Lower case to upper case and upper case to lower case. And check if the given character is lower, convert into upper. If the given character is upper, convert into lower. I hope you understood. For more videos, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and Facebook group. Thank you. Have a nice day.